Rob and Empey. We're on another dealer visit, beautiful Hawaiian Gardens, California. We are at Vintage Motor Cars, and I want to introduce you to our man Greg. Greg? How you doing? I'm well, and yourself? Good, doing good. It's uh, quite an operation you have here. The cars are beautiful. Thank you. We, we want to know, how did this all get started? I used to work for uh, Kirk that started this business back in 1987. Mm -hmm. And uh, I was just started as a grunt, putting chassis together, mm -hmm. going to the junkyard, grabbing parts. Mm -hmm. And then he sold me the spider business in 1995. Okay. And I was building spiders up until about 2017. And then mm -hmm. when Kirk sold the business, mm -hmm. um, I, the new guys that bought it, mm -hmm. they moved it to Arizona, let all the guys go. Oh, wow. So I thought it was a smart thing to do to hire all of his ex-employees. Mm -hmm. And I was able to lease the building. and put this business back together and combine the spider, the mm -hmm. speedster, and also the coupe. So I got to ask, somebody walks in and says, hey, I want a car. Mm -hmm. Can you walk me through the steps of the process? I have like a base car, like let's say for the speedster. Mm -hmm. We have a base car that comes with four wheel disc brakes, mm -hmm. 2332 engine, okay. 344 ring and pinion transmission, mm -hmm. heated seats, VDO gauges, wow. and then you choose the color of the car on the mm -hmm. interior and exterior. Okay. And then we have an option sheet and they'll check the boxes for the mm -hmm. options that they want. Mm -hmm. And then that will obviously, depending on the options, will add to the cost of the car. Sure. And then right now we have about a 22 month wait. We have over a hundred plus cars on order. Wow. Good so for you. So we're super busy yeah. and that's how it starts. So talk to me about the operation. What I noticed walking in is you have a lot of cars going on. Mm -hmm. I see a lot of pans. Um, I see a lovely office manager. I see a puppy. Can you walk us through the different steps? Yeah, yeah, we can do that. You want to walk through? Or? Yeah, please. Okay. Yes. Well, this is what we start with right here. Uh -huh. We have people. This is a Volkswagen chassis. Uh, we put empty pan halves in them. Mm -hmm. uh, we put new pan heads if we need to. Mm -hmm. uh, we cut out any rust that needs to be done, mm -hmm. any bad sections, and we replace it. Beautiful. This is what we end up with assembly. So let's go into the shop. I'll show you how the chassis are done and how the cars are assembled. Awesome. So we put each chassis in a jig, got the front beam in place, uh, the rear torsion setup is all set in place. Okay. We take uh, about 12 inches out of the chassis, mm -hmm. shorten them up, uh, put all new pan sections in. This one uh, was a Super Beetle, uh -huh. we cut the Super Beetle head off, and we're putting one of your empty uh, ball joint frame heads on there. So Greg, it looks like these, are, these cars are all new from the tires up, is that right? Pretty much, um, mm -hmm. we rebuild the front ends, mm -hmm. all new ball joints, tie rods, steering boxes, mm -hmm. German steering donuts, um, has your disc brake kit front and rear, transmissions are rebuilt, mm -hmm. uh, all new brake lines, master cylinder, hoses, e-brake handles, tr uh, transmission mount. Uh -huh. Not just saying that to make pieces. me feel good, right? No, not at all. But it's making me but feel we do, good. We do use a lot of your stuff. Thank you, So we appreciate that. Yes. This looks beautiful, so that chassis, the bodies that we looked at, so they come together in here. So tell me what happens. So they come together, and once they're together, then we put all new brand new wire harnesses. Uh, we put video gauges, which we get from you guys. And square weave carpet, brand new tops, all new top frames, uh, wood steering wheels. Got a, This one has a retro radio. Hey Greg, it looks like something missing here. Can you help me? Yeah, the motor's not in this one yet, okay. but we can go over and show you how we do the motors yeah, if you want to go over here. Let's have huh? a look. Greg, so this is uh, one of my favorite parts. Motor City is where I like to be. I see some empty parts here. I like that. Now, I understand 2332 is your, your go-to motor. Can you tell me and, and our viewers why? Uh, well, we did a 2332 because with the 84 millimeter crank and the big board, it's going to give you a lot of torque. Mm -hmm. And we built this, these motors more for torque than we did horsepower. And we have a really good package. Uh, put together with the help of uh, Pat Downs from Pat Downs Performance, mm -hmm. and we have a good, great cam heads, uh, all the all the internal stuff, compression ratio, all mm -hmm. that stuff set up really good, so it's super reliable. Sure. So it's a proven, uh, reliable motor. Maybe it doesn't make the most horsepower, but it gives you the most fun feel in this car. So Greg, looks like we've got a customer car ready for delivery here. Can yep. you tell me, kind of walk me through it? Okay. Yeah. This one has a. 2332cc engine in it. Mm -hmm. uh, it has a lot of your sheet metal, um, your Cadron carburetors. Mm -hmm. That's the carburetor we like to use with this package. It's a real simple carburetor. Mm -hmm. it has European tail lights, bumper guards. Uh, this one has a louver deck lid. It has our baseball color interior and carpet. Our standard wood steering wheel. Vintage 190 aluminum wheels. Moon hubcaps. 
trunk carpet in the front. Beautiful. And also has a set of uh, fog lights up front as well. Oh, very pretty. Awesome. Can we, you uh, can you start it up? Can sure. you hear it? Yeah, absolutely. Well, Greg, thank you so much for the tour. Really, really enjoyed it. No if our viewers want to learn more, where should you? Where should? Where can we direct them? Uh, to our website, which is vintagemotorcarsinc.com, mm -hmm. and there's a link off of our website to our Instagram account. There's a lot of pictures mm -hmm. and information on our Instagram as well. And I appreciate you guys coming out, having a tour. Perfect. Thanks so much. Thank you.